One simple use for Padlet is to use Padlet as a wall for students to turn in work. So you can see that I'm at Padlet.com and I'm already signed into an account. So then I'm going to go ahead and go to create a new Padlet. To visit the Padlets you've created, you would click Padlets. So it's going to create a wall for me. This just takes but a second to just give it a title. So turn in your math project here, whatever the title is. Um, I usually put double click anywhere to add your link. You might have them include their name. Um, so put the directions that you want. Then basically if I go to the gear and address, you can make this a very easy address for your students. So this is a Granger fourth grade account um, and I could even call it turn in pick that if it's available. Notice that if I go to layout, you're going to probably want to choose grid so that everything is very neat and organized and nothing's on top of each other. And then privacy, this is just saying that anybody can write on the wall so anybody can double click to turn in their project. And then if you want to share, if it's easier for your students to get to this link by QR code, um, you can go ahead and copy and paste that QR code as well. If you're one who wants to change the background, those are always features that you can go through and change. So here, as long as the kids have this link or scan the QR code, they can double click and then they can insert a URL. So this is another Padlet that they've done, a Prezi. Um, they can even upload a file. So if they've done PowerPoint, Word document, PDF, anything like that. And then as the teacher, if you are at this website or in your Padlet account, you will have all of your student work on one wall.